Company engineer Shantanu Mulut, who is wanted in the Greta Thunberg toolkit case, was present at the farmers' protest site at Delhi's Tikri border between January 20 and 27, the police said on Tuesday. The information was revealed as the police were interrogating 21-year-old climate activist Disha Ravi, who was arrested from Bengaluru on Saturday. Disha Ravi, along with Shantanu and lawyer Nikita Jacob, is accused of creating a protest toolkit backing the farmers' agitation with the aim of tarnishing the image of India and collaborated with pro-Khalistani elements. While Delhi police's cyber cell has arrested Disha Ravi, Nikita and Shantanu remain absconding. The two have filed for an anticipatory transit bail in the Bombay High Court. Their pleas will be heard on Tuesday. While Jacob's plea was filed in Mumbai, Muluk submitted his application in the Aurangabad bench of the High Court. The police on Monday said that Disha, Nikita and Shantanu attended a Zoom meeting organized by pro-Khalistani group Poetic Justice Foundation on January 11, 15 days ahead of the Republic Day violence in the national capital. Joint Commissioner of Police Cyber Prem Nath said that the meeting was aimed at deciding the modalities to create the toolkit titled Global Farmers Strike and Global Day of Action the 26th of January. It included plans for online as well as physical action to back farmers protest on January 26th Prem Nath said on Monday. According to the new information revealed by Delhi police on Tuesday, Shantanu was present at the protest site at Tikri border in the days leading up to the January 26th tractor rally and left the site a day after. During her interrogation, Disha Ravi has also revealed the names of two other suspects in the case. One of these suspects is abroad and the other is in India, the police said. The police are currently conducting raids to nab the suspect, they said.